You hear that, guys? No body checking! Today, the Upper Deck Vs have found a competitor worthy of the challenge, the Okanagan Hockey Academy, who take this sport seriously, although it's said that these players are rather young. Are they older than five? <laughs> in this corner, weighing in at full strength, is the Penticton Upper Deck Vs, the special needs hockey team that lives by three rules. Number one, learn to play hockey at any age. Number two, have fun doing it. And number three, turn disability into ability. Let's get this party started! I got to pick my number. It's my lucky number. Lacing up as number six, Sarah Half Dozen Francis. When she's not scoring goals, she's working as a prep cook in town, and she loves hockey. I enjoy it. When I get on that ice, it makes me happy. I could have a really bad day, and going on that ice just makes me happy. Woo! It went in! <laughs> I did figure skating when I was, like, really young, but I've never played hockey. I, Tyler told me about hockey, and so I started, and I really liked it, so... I've met a lot of different people on this team and I think it's a great way to get people to get together and I hang out with some of them after, outside of hockey. A lot of the times it's hard to find people to play. So when we do have games, we all get really excited, so. <laughs> Go Santa! Please and thank you! I love you! I'm number 13, lucky 13. Andrew the Canadian Rocket Stenhouse is number 13. They used to call him the Zamboni, but now he's a lightning left winger who works maintenance with the Penticton District Society for Community Living. When I was younger, I uh, wanted to do something so great because I had an inspiration for hockey since I was a little kid. That I wanted to uh, live my dream of becoming a hockey player like my brother. I was in Manitoba during the summer. My brother is a professional hockey player. Better than me, we call him Rain Gretzky, but he trained me up to become better because my first year didn't go so well last year. He helped me buy a pair of rollerblades, and uh, we went and we went out and uh, and uh, skated around this uh, around around the little town he was in, and he taught me how to skate forwards and backwards and shoot with accuracy with a hockey stick. I'm doing better this year because uh, after uh, because after my training session from my brother and a little bit of medication. It actually helps me play better, and the coaches were stunned. And they, instead of calling me Zamboni or the or Crash, they called me the Rocket. But I prefer to be called Canadian Rocket. I think he's improved a lot since I've seen him play. I think everybody has different abilities. Um, yeah, they usually teach us in different ways that they wouldn't normally teach a person without special needs. Like, if we don't get it, they'll explain it in a different way so that we do understand it. The coaching is fabulous. They're, they're, they're incredible. They just want you to be the best. They want you to see your inner spirit within, and they want you to be the best. And that's the best thing. Jason is just like a, is like a father to me. He reminds me a lot of my brother. We don't argue with each other because sometimes people do get jealous of other people's abilities, but we all have to pitch in and keep and chip in and help each other out. Especially especially for my first year. I didn't so didn't so well, but they all kept on cheering me on that I always that you can do better, you can do better, and I did. And then there's uh, Tony, he's number ten of our team. He's the one who scores the goals for us. And there's uh, Jake, he's our goalie. He's nothing gets past him at all. He's quite good. And we also have John and John and Dave. Right? They are our defense guys, and nothing gets past those guys. We all have different abilities of how we play our game of hockey. It's always next time, guys. Always next time. So it went very well. I was crying pressed. Uh, we may have lost or we may win. I have no idea. But we played a good game tonight. I'm proud of myself. I'm going to go home, and I'm going to sleep well tonight. That's, that's all it matters to me. Good job, brother.